FT squad. It's been so long. Okay, okay, okay. So today's a special day. Today is a special day. We having a big birthday party today for Bella Easton. So we celebrating for our babies. Say what's up, Mason. Oh. <laughs> We are celebrating, having a birthday party for our babies. And so let me show y'all, let me show y'all. I'm gonna turn the camera on. Okay, so here you have Easton set up. Daddy the tiger that he loves. And then you have Bella set up. Look, say it's my party and I cry if I want to. Cry if I want to. Cry if I want to. Come on, he wanna go in the moonwalk. Come on, Papa. Bella, where is the birthday girl? I know you see it, right? Bella, hey, Ethan. Hey, hey, Papa. Whoa. <laughs> Papa, look. First time in the mountain. Put your coat on. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Too much for you? You gotta stand so you can see the. Uh, hi, Poppy. Uh, the it's your birthday. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, so whose birthday are we celebrating? Emma! I'm Easton! Oh, happy birthday! Happy birthday, Easton! What's your name, singer? Bella. Bella? Oh, well, it's so nice to meet you. Are you excited for some reptiles? Yeah! Yes? All right, you guys. So, um, first things first, my name is Devin. It's so nice to see everyone this evening. Um, so we are all celebrating, um, you know, Bella's and Easton's birthday. Give me a round of applause. Now they are all super friendly, but before we get started, I do have to ask, is there anybody here that's a little nervous or scared of the reptile? Okay, well, you guys are, okay, well that's good, that's good. Well, if I do have anybody that's a little nervous or scared, just know that all of my um, reptile friends here today, um, and he's just going to hang out right here with you for a moment, alright? Now if you would like, um, do you want me to hold this and you want to pet him real quick? I'll hold your green pop. Yeah, there you go. Can you go ahead and pet him for me? Is he so nice? Oh, okay, good. All right, you guys. So we're seeing how friendly Zombie is, um, and we're gonna show everyone his favorite spot. Okay. So remember, I told you he comes from a little island. Now on that island, one of his favorite things to do is climb. All right. So I'm gonna have you hold your ring pop, and we're going to have Zombie go to his favorite spot. All right, which is the very tip top of most trees. Today we have our Bella tree. Are y'all ready? And ta-da! Actually, 
actually regrow his tail back, all right? So can you go ahead and fill this for me, Bella? Does it feel like a squishy marshmallow? And look, it jiggles like jello. <laughs> now, if you feel his back, it's gonna feel a little bumpy, like a rocky or sandy floor, and that's because it helps him camouflage out in the wild. Not just by the way he looks, but by the way he feels. So it's like double camouflage powers, all right, you guys? So, that being said, um, Bella, how brave are you? Like, really brave. Oh, perfect. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna put Spot on his favorite spot, which is gonna be right here on your shoulder, and we're just gonna cover you in a few geckos, all right? Okay. Here we go.
you, you want to look up? Oh, well, yeah, there you go. And we're going to put them right here, Bella, right here in this. Can you help me put them in here? Oh, yeah, I'll help you, I'll help you. Good job. Right in there, just put them down. Perfect. All right, you guys, we're going to go through our next two very quickly. Now, Bella, I'm going to hand them to you. Our next friend, his name is Piggy, okay? Piggy! Piggy! Yeah. Piggy! Okay. Now, Piggy, here he is. Piggy is called a sulcata tortoise, also known as an African spur thigh tortoise. Now, this guy looks a little different because he comes from the African desert. Now, he is one of my favorite tortoise species because even though he looks so little and cute right now, um, he is only three years old. He, he can actually um, become the world's third largest tortoise species at about 200 pounds and live to be up over 100 years old. So this guy has a lot of growing to do. Go ahead, sweetheart. Um, well, he was actually born right here in the United States, but all of his distant cousins and everything come from the African desert. That is where they're native to, out in the wild. That's where you would find them. So, great question. In the back, guys, you want to go to safari and everything? It's time they have even trips. So, they like eat lots of grass and hay and veggies and plants. Um, all right, Bella, do you guys? So all three of these tortoises are from all around the world. This guy, even though he's the largest, he is only four and a half years old. He can get to be only about 30 to 40 pounds, where Piggy will get to be 200 pounds, all right? Oh, wow. Yeah, and this one's the mama. <laughs> can you go ahead and give him a little more? Yeah, there we go. In just a second, we are going to do some cool things, but first, we are going to do it. You want me to hold on right here? All right, you guys, so Boudin, the blue-tongued skink lizard, he comes from Australia. Now he has that bright blue tongue to look big and scary and poisonous and deadly to creatures out in the wild, but he's not act actually poisonous or dangerous at all. Those holes are his ears, okay? Yeah, those are just his ears so he can hear you. Now, Bella's gonna show us how friendly Boudin is. So Bella, can you act like you're gonna give him a big hug? Put your arms out. Perfect, just like that. Awesome, Bella. Good job. All right, you guys. So what these uh, what these lizards will actually do out in the wild is they will open their mouth. They will stick out that bright blue tongue and unfold it and expand it to be the size of their head. All right. So he won't do that to us today because he's very friendly and used to humans. Um, but the ones out in the wild definitely would do that to try and scare away predators. Now, as you can see, very friendly. He likes to give lizard hugs, but there is one more thing he likes to do. And Bella, basically, his favorite thing to do is give big, wet lizard kisses. No! 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 Kiss! All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If y'all not quiet, it's gonna come out attacking everyone. <laughs> so, you have to be quiet. <laughs> All right, you guys, don't cry. Um, okay, you guys, so um, our very last animal of the day, our grand finale reptile, her name is Peep. So, if y'all can say Peep. She is so tiny and adorable and cute, just like the little peeps, you guys. So that is why we named her that. So Bella, can you come and help me? Yeah, Bella, yeah, Bella. Go, Bella. Go, Bella. Go, Bella. Go, Bella. Go, Bella. Go, Bella. Can you put your hands up just like this? Over there. All right, guys. We are going to get ready for the very last one. Is this small? Well, we would want her to hit her head on the top when she jumps, right? Okay, so that's why she, that's why she's on a giant, she's in a giant box, all right? So here we go, you guys. Here goes. Oh no, that's a bow. Oh, 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 oh.
What's happening? What happened? Why are we all scared? He doesn't know it's her. All right, you guys. Um, Peep is called an albino Burmese python. Now, when I said she's tiny and cute and adorable, yes, that's my opinion, you guys. But I do mean it, okay? She's about six and a half to seven foot long and about 30 to 35 pounds. Uh, how would you put her All right, can you put your arms out just like this, sweetheart? And my other friends, can y'all give us just a little bit to your back? Just for a little bit, okay? <laughs>
Thank you.